Despite having more capacity under that new tier, many businesses don't have the staff to manage it. The CBS 13's Ryan Hill with the hiring hurdles that some Yolo County restaurants are now facing. Yolo County restaurants may be toasting to the orange tier in the 50% indoor dining capacity that comes with it. But finding people to make that adjustment has been a struggle for people like Danielle Betancourt. She's trying to fill several positions at the Streets of London pub in West Sacramento. Oh yeah, I had somebody who I reached out to on Facebook who said that he had just gotten fired who didn't show up to an interview today. The owner of Pete's Restaurant and Brew House in Woodland in the same boat. Now we're going weeks without anybody showing up for even an interview. She says one of the biggest problems bringing on new hires, the yo-yo effect. That also comes with the state's tier system. At first, I was able to maintain 80% of my staff, and then the second time we shot, I lost another 10%. The third time we shot, I lost another 10%. And, you know, people are going, well, I can't be in a job where it's not secure, and I have to feed my family. But Betancourt thinks the last draw for some is the industry itself. And the thought of going back to work and how hard we work is kind of daunting to them. 50% capacity indoor dining on the table, but with the side of reality for many. Absolutely. Yeah, not at this time. I mean, it's going to take us months to get back to where we were. I want to give the best possible service, and I, it's hard to staff appropriately when I can't find people for the positions. A tough break for some restaurants, preparing to serve more customers with fewer employees. Stay strong. We got this. And this can't be ignored. Both owners say unemployment could also be a factor in the lack of new hires, meaning some people are getting benefits equal to their old pay.